What's good, YouTube? It is your boy, Big Cool, coming to you from Colossal Sports TV. And I am back with another video. Before I get into the video, go ahead and smash that like button, hit that subscribe button, and that post notification bell to get notified every time I upload content to the channel. Also, follow me on Instagram at Colossal underscore Sports TV. If you hear anything, man, it's raining uh, I'm out here. But, man, I want to talk about some shit that, you know, is affecting, um, affecting the black community in terms of our ability to work together and kind of overcome small petty beefs. I was watching my brother uh, from the Boston Clinic, CJ Goodfella, uh, his video, uh, point of view video, new media versus old media and fake love shown uh, him and his channel. And he made up a, a lot of great points. You know, he 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 briefly um, speak uh, spoke on it. You know, this channel used to be called Colossal Box and Talk. Um, now it's changed to Colossal Sports TV. Obviously, um, myself and my my homie Smooth Cat. Shout out to him. We came together and we formed it. But obviously, you know, difference of views and growth and doing other things. You know, obviously leaves me to you know the long guy um, to keep it pushing. You know, forward. Uh, CJ was also a part of it. You know, our boy Mighty Mouse, um, Miguel Torres was a part of it. My boy John JG was a part of it. Um, obviously, we still all talk, uh, communicate, and, and, and rock with each other and support each other. But like he said, you know, difference of um, how things should be done kind of, you know, led him to leaving. And it wasn't necessarily between me and him, you know, um, more so him and you know another individual but that's neither here nor there um it, it is what it is but we all overcame that we still chop it up every day like he said in his video um but the thing about it is is that everybody um is trying to get into this boxing game you know what i'm saying whether it's through youtube whether it's through facebook twitter instagram um writing uh whatever it is doing podcasts we all trying to make it and get somewhere you know what I'm saying? We all love this uh this this boxing shit, man. 24/7 we love it. We love it like you know, we love football or basketball. You know what I'm saying? It's one of the best sports ever that was ever, you know what I'm saying, formed. And for us to be kind of beefing or, you know, there to be any tension that can't be spoke upon directly um like men is one of the main reasons why we won't prosper. Um as a community, you know what I'm saying? Like, me and CJ were kind of in some, in a YouTube beef, if you want to call it that. I'm not going to mention the guy's name. This is no way um, any shade thrown or anything like that. This is just me being 100, you know what I'm saying? We was on a hangout and we was cracking jokes. Um, it got back to a certain individual. He felt the need to, to make a video about it. Uh, it started over some petty shit that... You know, I'm not even gonna get into it because I wasn't even on on a on a uh, a stream of uh, CJ's when this shit was going down. But you know, me and him was chopping it up, watching the fights, Errol Spence, Carlos Ocampo fight card, and we was just doing what we would regularly do. If it wasn't even watching boxing, if we was just kicking it, you know what I'm saying? We cracking jokes, chilling, whatever, laughing. But anyway, we was in a beef. You know what I'm saying? A lot of y'all might not know. You know what I'm saying uh, about Colossal Sports TV. You know, of course, I got 1,100 some subscribers. Shout out to each and every one of you all uh, that that rock with me. Um, my channel ain't where it's, where I want it to be, um, but I feel I need to let y'all know that I put work in. You know what I'm saying? And I love this, and I support any and every brother or sister out there. You know what I'm saying? You know, <clears throat> and CJ can he can attest for it. all the work we did back in the day how we grinded how we hustled to get where we at i'm not even nowhere near where i wanted to go i took a um you know a long break i had a a, a loss that i'm not gonna dwell on um cj know about the loss that i suffered uh about five months ago you know so it kind of you know took my mind away from boxing um but i think that the shit that we were kind of the little beef we was in, that shit could have been avoided. For one, I was cracking jokes, just being funny. Um, but it could have been avoided before we even got to that point. You know, with all with a simple word, communication, could have hit my boy up and like, hey, bro, I was offended by whatever whatever had went on. You know what I'm saying? And this shit would have been cool. You know, um, 
But if we can't come together over a sport we love, what can we come over, um, come together over, you know? And it's not to be no political or anything like that. This is just being real. You know what I'm saying? We got to be genuine towards one another. You know, we got to be transparent. We got to keep it real. We got to put all that feelings and shit on the table. You know what I'm saying? We got to work together. You know what I'm saying? We got to push forward. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? There's no need to be jumping on each other's backs, trying to one-up somebody when we could be working together. You got to understand, some people's success is going to come quicker, you know what I'm saying, than others. And CJ, one of the main guys that keep me going in this YouTube thing, man. I, and that's on everything I love. You know what I'm saying? That's on the Bible. You know, uh, I tell him that he know it. You know what I'm saying? The way his, his work ethic, man. The way he put out the videos. The way he just 100% himself. You know what I'm saying? He not caring about her opinion. He not caring about who is going to um, affect, who, who whose feathers is going to ruffle. He just put it out there. And the work, the growth of his channel, the... The response he gets from people uh, on a day-to-day -day basis on his videos, it speaks for itself. So that's somewhere I, I, I aspire to get to that level. You know what I'm saying? Of course, me and CJ, two, do two totally different people with two totally different personalities. You know what I'm saying? Um, but we both got knowledge. We both got passion. We both got love for the sport. Or it just, in any, you know, just in general, anything we do. So I'm going to always support him. You know what I'm saying? He was talking about he was thinking about shutting down his channel. I said, no, nah, bro, that's definitely, definitely not what you need to be doing. You didn't work too hard to let some some fake love or some ill will from other individuals, you know, get you to the point where you just throwing it away. You know what I'm saying? And I'm pretty sure he's going to keep going going strong with, with the boxing clinic and more. And I advise y'all to check it out, man. He be on fire, man. And it just me not... <laughs> You know, over I'm not praising him, I'm just giving him his just due. You know what I'm saying? Because somebody gotta, you know, recognize when a motherfucker put in that work for real. And I definitely recognize it. Um I wanna shout out my guys at the movement, man, who I rock with heavy. 2K from the Prodigy of Boxing Talk. I know y'all know about him. One of the most knowledgeable dudes that I know. I'm learning from him constantly. You know what I'm saying? Willie the Kid, another knowledgeable cat, um, from Eastwick Boxing, you know. Dude knows his shit. You know, Seabone Henderson uh, from Four Corners Boxing Talk. You know, journalist, he's taking me on his wing. You know what I'm saying? Showing me the ropes uh, with with the writing and everything. Those three guys I just mentioned, they came together to form 3 kingsboxingcom a site that I write for. You know, so shout out to them. And, and last but not least, uh, from the movement, my boy Bo, you know, from Truth and Facts About Boxing, another knowledgeable cat that I learned so much from. So those four cats, man, I learned a hell of a lot from. You know, shout out to my guys that used to be CBT, JG, Mouse, um, Smooth Cat. Um, I learned from them. You know, them still my bros. I still talk to them. You know what I'm saying? Shout out to the LDBC, 78 um, Sports TV, Black Fight Fan TV. Just came across him a few months ago. Definitely, uh, you know, enjoy his content. You know what I'm saying? Uh, bar barbershop Conversations. Shout out to him. Shout out to my boy Cali, the Cali Enigma um, show. He the homie. I, should, hey, I, I met him through uh, CJ. And, you know, me, him, and CJ got some shit brewing for y'all. Football uh, and, and college basketball heads that, you know, love, love college football and basketball. We got some shit that we about to do. Um, so stay tuned for that. Shout out to my boy Trap House Boxing. You know what I'm saying? Um, one of the guys that was showing me love, checking my shit out. And like I said, like I said, going through this trap, you know, one of the, you know, a uh, painful experience that I was going through, I kind of fell out, you know, f you know, interacting with people, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, the videos was there, but it wasn't, it wasn't there like how I wanted to, to be there. Um, but yeah, shout out to Trap House Boxing, uh, shout out to the whole LDBC, um, and just shout out to everybody that's doing their thing, man. Um, it's too many to name. Um, but I rock with y'all. Just know that boxing ego, uh, you know, I rock with him. And so, you know, it's just a, it's just a lot of people I, I, I rock with and I choose to support. Um, and I just want everybody to come together. You know what I'm saying? Um, like I said, man, it, it, it's too much money out here. It's too many opportunities out here for us to be at each other's throat over some shit that don't, don't even matter. Just cracking jokes or whatever. Like I said, it's not a video to throw shade at anybody. You know what I'm saying? So hopefully nobody take it that way. But if they do, they entitled to feel how they feel. 
Um, but man, like I said, man, those are people I rock with. If I didn't mention you, I'm pretty sure I forgot. There's a lot of channels that I watch. Um, but those guys that I mentioned are the ones I watch the most. You know what I'm saying? Because I take some from each and every one of those cats. Um, whether it's the knowledge, the presentation, the personality, the, the you know, the delivery, whatever it may be, I take some from them. You know what I'm saying? So I definitely fucks with all them cats, man. And hopefully uh, people that start to continue to come in on the channel enjoy the content. Um, I'm going to do more things than just boxing. You know, cover some movies, cover some TV, cover some all kind of shit, man. But it's still a primary boxing um, channel. I got some big interviews that I'm going to line up, um, you know, uh, for y'all in the coming weeks and whatnot. So, like I said, man, rock with me. Drop your comments in the comment section down below. Give me your thoughts on it, man. It's not, a, it's not a boxing topic per se, but it's just some real life shit that we need to come together. You know, stop all the petty uh, beefs over nothing, over miscommunication. We can just communicate, pick up the phone text, um, email, Facebook, however we uh, connect it and, and, and just go that route before we, you know, negatively, publicly just diss each other. You know what I'm saying? Cause that's, that's not going to lead to growth. It might lead to a temporary growth, but it's not, it's not going to be where you really wanted to go. Um, you know, in the future when you, if you want to become relevant and stay relevant. So man, we just got to come together, continue to support each other. Um, Network, work together, and just be, you know, 100% real, man. Shout out to the movement again. Check out 3kingsboxing.com for your latest and greatest updated, unfiltered, and unbiased boxing news. Reported the way it should be. Shout out to my boy, um, CJ from the Boxing Clinic and more. Shout out to the LDBC. Um, it's next time I'm out. Peace.